Hello guys. Um, I would like to talk about. I would like to talk about uh, Michael Todd versus Evgeny Prudnik uh, heavyweight East versus West world title with right arm. Okay, there have been some questions about how Michael can get a title match or title match while he already has two losses in previous East versus West events. Um, I would like to say that first of all, Michael's losses uh, at the previous East versus West were in super heavyweight category, and. He is recently 115 kilo, and he will pull Prudnik at for the 110 kg 242 East versus West World Title match with right arm. And people who closely uh, follow East versus West and my posts on the community page and also YouTube videos, they will know that. Uh, according to the rules of East versus West, if both athletes they agree with each other, they can pull up to five kg over the weight category. Only if both athletes agree with each other. So, Evgeny and Michael they agreed to pull at 115 kg, which is 253 pounds, and Michael currently is just going between 247 and 255 it's all up to how strict he is on his diet you know like in a few days he, he can go down to 247 and he just starts eating and he goes 255 so even if he is around 260 to make 253 uh one and a half day before the competition we do the competition on uh, saturday evening night and then uh, the weigh-in is on uh, Friday morning, so he can easily be 253 on the way in and 260 when he is competing. So after Prudnik's performance against uh, Todd Hutchings at the last East versus West, to me it seems like the guy is kind of all alone in that category. No disrespect, but as of now, he looks ahead, one head above the rest in his own weight category. Maybe if, if Ongarbe gains some weight, if John comes in a super shape, or Iraq gains some more weight, he is just 95 kilo, 110 kilo, or 105 kilo, uh, Iraq could be very dangerous. Um, but as of now, you know, Prudnik looks alone there, and to me, he is strong enough to pull against the super heavyweights from now on. So, um, but you know, even he is, uh, how to say, like ready to pull the super heavyweights, he also, he is also holding a title at 242, 110 kg category, and he needs to also defend his title so um like someone like michael todd who has been pulling in super heavyweight category and you know to me in my opinion it is one of the like best possible choices like for prudnik to pull and defend his title you know because michael has been pulling in the super heavyweight category even he has losses, as you see that you know he is going head to head with those top super heavyweights, and and I think he is a very good choice because of his uncomfortable style as well. And in my opinion, Michael at his new weight looks much more healthier and athletic compared to his super heavyweight version. 
Um, and also remember that Michael was only 118 kilo, so a little bit less than probably 260 um, when he beat Pushkar, uh, rest in peace, uh, about what 10 years ago, 11 years ago. And so I think that it would be a good match. And also, lastly, I need to uh, remind uh, the fans that when Prudnik said that his chance is 50-50 against Michael, many people said that Prudnik is being humble. Uh, but my friends, um, like even when I offer him the match privately, he had very hard time to accept that match. He said, Michael is very, very uncomfortable for him. And the truth, he asked for another opponent. You know, that, that is the truth, you know. Prudnik is my friend and I don't think that he would mind me saying this because he also openly said this. But many people thought that he was saying this because he was so humble. And as we know that Prudnik <laughs> doesn't try to be humble, you know, the way that he's challenging his opponents and everything, how he, he will do the risk score with the opponent, how he will rub the head and this and that. And so he really believes that it's a very hard matchup for him. So I just wanted to explain like how the things are. And I'm expecting a tough match. And um, I see a close match. Um, I'm not saying Prudnik cannot win. Prudnik may have edge, but I will not be surprised if Michael beats Prudnik. So that is all I wanted to share with you guys. So you all take care and thank you for your continuous support.